So here's some synthesized crystals of MOF5. Uh, MOF5 is the, the most popular or the, the most well-known MOF. It was the first MOF synthesized in this lab. Uh, in order to make it, you would mix zinc, which is the inorganic component, with terephthalic acid, the organic component, in a vial uh, with either DMF or DEF as a solvent. And after we've swirled it and make sure we have a homogeneous solution, we're ready to put it in the oven. We'll put it in a 60 to 120 degree oven from anywhere to several hours to several days. After synthesizing the metal organic frameworks, we can use powder x-ray and single x-ray diffraction to help us solve the structure. After we determine the structure of our materials, we can use thermal gravimetric analysis to help us determine the, to, the heat stability of the molecules. The instrument behind me here is an autosorb. This instrument gives us insight into the surface area and porosity of our materials. It also gives us information about the capabilities of our materials for uh, gas absorption for carbon dioxide, methane, hydrogen, and other gases such as nitrogen and argon. My name is Kaylin. I'm a graduate student in the Aggie Lab here at UCLA.